Yo, what is up guys? Hope you're all having a fantastic day. So the next two operations have been revealed by 343, which is Tenrai 4 and Spartan Surplus. And thanks to the Silex Guide, we now know what these operations will contain. So we're going to be breaking that down. But before we get into that, I do want to mention that most of the rewards are going to be Spartan points. So I'm just going to skip all those tiers that are Spartan points and just get straight to the rewards. So if you see me jumping from number to number, that's because the tiers before that are just Spartan points. We're going to start with the Tenrai 4 operation. So for the first tier of this operation pass, we got an emblem here, which is called Floral Crest. And up until tier 5 is when we get another reward, which is a hip attachment called Thousand Coin Price. And then we skip over to tier 10 for the next reward, which is Sea Glass Waves, and that is a visor. And if we go ahead and skip over 5 more tiers to the next reward, we got a chest attachment. And on to tier 18, we got some shoulder pads, which is called Secondary Mandate. And of course, you get both of them, the left and right shoulder. And for the final tier, on tier 20, we get a helmet, which is called, I mean, I'm going to butcher this as well but it's like Ezeki or Ezechi I don't know and on that same tier we also get the helmet attachment for that helmet so those are all the rewards for the Tenrai 4 event of course it's focused on the Yorai core and all the tiers I didn't mention are just Spartan points now let's move on to the Spartan surplus operation so for the first tier of this operation we got an emblem which is called blade and barbs and up until tier 10 is when we get the next reward which is called the Mackie macro bionics or something like that and this is a hip attachment for the Mirage Core. So the next tier where we actually get a reward is tier 15 which is actually a vehicle coating which is called Crimson Anchor. On to the next tier that has a reward is tier 18 which is a shoulder pad for the Mark 4 Core and this one's called Tac Gregor which has like the shock and shells. Pretty cool. And for the final tier on tier 20 we get a Mark 4 helmet which is called Okanom. But yeah that is the final tier for this operation. Once again I'm just going to mention it just so people know all the tiers i didn't mention are just going to be spartan points i'm just showcasing all the actual rewards so that about wraps up the operation passes who knows if we're going to get any like cool playlist or something themed after these operations i'm hoping so because that'd be great but so far there's no knowledge on or at least that's public as to if we're going to get any cool like event themed playlist or something like that there is still two forge maps that have not released yet that are made by sparasoft in 343 so it might be like one one of those maps for each of these operations which is the Skyport map and the Reverent remake of Relic from Halo 2 BTB map. So it's probably going to be those two maps. Uh, maybe one for each operation. I don't know. That's just my guess. But that about wraps up this video. Let me know what you guys think about the operation passes. With that being said, consider subscribing and liking the video if you want to see more Halo content like this. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.